Good morning. I want to share something with you today. And it's from the book of 1 John chapter 4, verse 1. 1 John chapter 4, verse 1, and I read. Dear friends, do not believe everyone who claim to speak by the Spirit. You must test them to see if the Spirit they have, they have comes from God. For there are many false prophets in the world. There are many false prophets in the world. Just a little encouragement this morning. There are people that speak different teachers, different prophets, different reverend, different pastors, different what and what, call all the titles. And people speak every day saying, God said, God said this, God said that. Now, how would you differentiate between those who are speaking truly from God and those who are speaking from their thinking? or those who are speaking from other spirits. Now, you as a child of God need to learn how to differentiate from these people. And this verse we read in 1 John 4, 1, it's saying that do not just believe everybody that say God said, but learn to test. Test the spirit to know if it comes from God. There are many spirits moving around, but which one comes from God? And how do you test? Someone will say, okay, how would I know that this is a true man of God? Or how would I know that this is a true prophet? Now, one of the ways or some of the ways we can know is the fruits they bear. The fruits they bear. Anyone telling you do this and their life is not showing that, just know that they are false prophets. A mango tree cannot give, give birth to a guava fruit. If they are from God, their fruits, the fruits they bear, you will see is that yes, these are good fruits they are bearing. If they are telling you to love, they should be able to love themselves. If they are telling you to give, they should be able to give themselves. If they are telling you anything a man of God tells you, he should be able to exemplify that. So the fruits they bear are one of the ways you will know that these words are from God. Secondly, another way to know if the fruits are from God is, is the Bible agreeing to that? Anything that someone is prophesying and the Bible is not agreeing to it, just know that it is not from God. If the Bible agrees with this thing that this man of God is saying, it's another way to test and know if what he is saying is from God. But if it is contrary to what the Bible is saying, just know that it's a wrong thing. Third way to test is when what the man of God is saying is yielding love. It's not bringing chaos, it's not bringing confusion, it's not bringing fights here and there. It's uniting people, it's bringing love to people, it's drawing men to God. These are words from God. Some prophet will tell you, that person said that, or that person did this to you, that is why you're facing this. Every prophet that tells you anything that causes war, Anything that causes disunity, anything that causes broken homes or broken relationship, be careful with those kind of people. They tell you stuff like that to break relationship. They tell you stuff like that to break homes. They tell you things like that to divide you. So this is another way you can test. If what they are saying will yield love, will draw men to God, the, the, the sum total of prophecy is, is sharing God's heart to people. I pray that God will give you the strength, the enablement to decipher when someone is from God and when someone is speaking of his own thoughts or someone is prophesying out of his own logic. I pray that you will not be deceived. I pray that you will not be... Uh, 
misled. May the Lord bless you. Do good to share this with others so that they too will know what you just know. Thank you and have a lovely day.